All right, well, my name is Helen Keeney. You're watching HSN, and I don't know if you've been watching the news today, but hurricanes are coming, and in places that we've never seen before. What does it make you think about emergency preparedness? That's why here at HSN, we have a one-day, one-day-only special of the EcoFlow. This is a product that I personally own. I'll be sharing personal stories of how I use it, some of the fun ways that I've used it, also for emergency preparedness here in Florida, which is known for its hurricanes. Um, we are doing one of the most powerful EcoFlows that we've ever had ever, ever, ever. It will power over 90% of all your appliances. We are also including, for the first time, and by the way, I got the solar panel when I got my EcoFlow, but I got the 110 watt solar panel that was included. This is a 160 watt solar panel. Why is the solar panel important to be included? Well, when the power goes out and you've got your EcoFlow, you can continuously charge it with the power of the sun. Our today's special price is $800 less than retail. If purchased separately, you're saving $800 off the solar panel and the EcoFlow. Let me show you the value. It's really, really extraordinary because the solar panel alone is $349, almost $350. You're also getting a power strip we, from EcoFlow because we, we want you to be all set. You wouldn't have to buy one other single thing. And then the EcoFlow Delta Max 2000, that to be honest, it's, it, that one's more powerful than the one I personally own. Uh, and it's $1,600. It's $1,987.99. But you are getting it today, one day, one day only, for $1,199. Now, we're also doing VIP financing. So if you have an HSN card, you have a year and a half to pay it off with no interest. So you can pay it a little bit, you know, even payments. Um, Jared, how much is even payments? If you've got, like, even payments you can do... $66 and 61 cents a month. So if you, it's a little bit under $67 a month. Or you can, you know, pay it off early, whatever you want to do, but it's a year and a half to pay it off and we ship immediately. These are in stock. Now here's the bad news that I got to tell you. I don't know if you've, how long you've been watching HSN today. Callie just had a full presentation. We've only, what is it, 221 over here on the East Coast. I'm hearing that this might be the final presentation of the day. Jared, how many exactly do we have left? Oh my gosh. Okay, there's 400, oh, there it is on the screen. There's 447 left. Another 20 sold since my last update, which was about 30 seconds ago. We think that every single one of these is gonna go in this presentation. I have an hour of Jambu shoes afterwards, please stay and watch. And then Justin and I, we're supposed to do an entire hour of this. I gotta be totally honest. I have no idea what I'm gonna be talking about in that hour. They're scrambling. <laughs> We're gonna, I'm gonna have something fun for you, but I have no idea what it is. But if you were at all thinking about it, you need to order it now. Justin Hyatt is our special guest. Come on out here, Justin. Um, this is obviously the perfect time. Yeah. I do wanna mention some of the other things that are available right away, yeah. since all those are gonna go too. We do have an extra battery that you can buy. Um, and then we also have a protection bag that is available. And then the other thing is an, a two pack of solar panels with a case. And I'd love for you to go through each one of those and tell us why that they're important. Uh, well, off the bat, you know, when you think about the, what this can do, not just 80%, 90%, 99% of your home appliances. With your refrigerator, you get 30 hours. If you're saying, well, I'd like to have double that without having to spend double the amount of money, yeah. that's why you get the extra battery. Because that extra battery is going to double the amount of power that you can have. You can actually have two additional extra batteries. So you can go from 2,000 kilowatts to 4,000 kilowatts, all the way to 6,000 kilowatts of power uh, okay. with your power station. That's just with the extra battery. And the extra battery is eight ninety nine ninety nine. And Jared, how many do we have left of the extra battery? Because I know that that was flying out the door. Okay, I have 475 extra batteries, okay? And then we also have the protection bag. I don't know if that's... The protection bag, I believe we have outside. I don't know if we can get that shot. Now, that is just really yeah. to protect your investment. So right. if you're a bit rugged with a lot of your devices... There it, it is. So the bag is... Uh, I know it's pretty dark out there, but that bag is over the unit itself. It's got ventilation. You can use the unit with that bag on it, so you don't have to worry about taking the bag off to, to uh, use it. So okay. it still does have its ventilation. Uh, but it's really just meant to protect your investment. And then 
then the other one is the two pack of the solar panels. Yeah, and so this is the really great part is we give you the 160 watt, like you mm -hmm. said. So we originally we had 110 watt and we've done that for years. Which is what I own. And most, of, and sometimes we don't even have the solar panels. Yeah. This is the upgraded version. This right, is 160 exactly. watt. You can have 800 watts of total solar input to your power station. So if you get two additional 160 watt solar panels, well, the more solar you have, the faster you'll be able to recharge your power station via the sun. So completely independent, off the grid, sustainable power. The other really cool thing though is, and I'm not gonna do the math because I'm terrible with math, but if you do 160 times three, you have that much solar that you'll be able to have pass through your power station. So this is what I mean, 160 watts of solar, passing through your power station to whatever you've got plugged in. Real, t real life uh, you know, application, your refrigerator is roughly about 30 watts of power when it's running, 30 watts of power. You have 160 watts. That means during the day, you'll be able to use the sun to power all of your electronics, and then when the sun goes down, you disconnect your solar panel, and then you're running just simply mm -hmm. off of your power station, and then the next day, use that solar mm -hmm. panel or solar panels to recharge your power station up to 100%. So full disclosure, while you're doing those wonderful descriptions, you I'm hearing- You weren't hearing anything. No, I was hearing <laughs> nothing out of your mouth. No, I was hearing what you're saying, but I'm hearing from Command Central yeah. that we are in touch with EgoFlow, telling them that our customers need more of these, and we're waiting to hear if they can, we call it loading more in our business, just to let you know we're trying to get more. Jared, how many do we have right now? Let's be completely full transparency. I have 416. If we do not get more, this will be the last presentation of the day. We are desperately trying, there is a possibility that we might get more, but at this exact moment, I don't wanna say that when this sells out, we won't have it anymore, because we are in contact with the um, EcoFlow folks. There is a possibility now that we might get more. Justin doesn't even, know that he, okay. we're, we are fall, we are finding this out in real time i think what happened is to, you know full disclosure we honestly underestimated how popular this was going to be uh well uh, yeah I, and i think it's just a combination it's a great offer it's a great time and it's a great product and it's a great brand um you know ecoflow is the number one when it comes to this category of sol solar generators yeah. and power stations too mm. i love when we do today's specials because it's not like you're gonna save 50 dollars <laughs> right 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 you're gonna save almost a thousand a thousand dollars on this so if somebody doesn't know what the ecoflow is what is the ecoflow why is it so popular today what is this what is What's this the cloud? what is this <laughs> what is this battery <laughs> that powers everything in our house and why not a gas generator. I'll tell you for myself, I don't want to have gasoline in my house. I don't want to have all the dangers of a gas generator. That's me personally. I've seen too many scary stories on the news yeah. about people who have tragedies from a gas generator. Um, and you cannot have it inside your house. So I don't know how I'm going to plug my, fr you know, I don't, I would just say that this is what I personally chose. So I think, I think that's story one is this or a gas generator. Well, ultimately, it's always been that. Right? Yeah. It's, okay, well, I see this, but why wouldn't I just get a gas generator? Why wouldn't I just get a propane generator? Well, immediately, you have to think about, well, what kind of home do you live in? If right. you live in an apartment or condo, you can't own a gas or propane generator. Well, you say, well, my building has a generator. That generator is only there to power up your elevators and your hallway lighting. Not for your ACs, not for your appliances. So you have to fend for yourself and consider what are my alternatives before there never was an alternative. Um, okay, now if you live in a conventional home, you're saying, well, Justin, it's just me. And I don't want a gas generator. I don't want a propane generator because it's too physically laboring. There's too much maintenance involved in it. Right. I have to do what? I've got to mix gas with something else. I've got to make sure that I prime it. I've got to make sure that I maintain it so that when I need to use all those different things that you might not consider when you go to purchase your gas generator because it's often like a reactionary purchase. Like we know there's a storm. So what are we supposed to do? We know right. we should get a generator. Uh, so you go get that generator and what happens to it? It sits and it's never used until the next time you need uh, 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 you know, power, you have an emergency. With this though, this is where you stretch your value and you stretch your dollar because you're right. getting something you can run inside. Right. You're getting something you can run anywhere in the country, take it with you, completely portable, completely silent. Comple yep. It's completely 
you know, fumeless, doesn't have any fumes that yeah. you have to worry about um, exhausting from, uh, you know, from your home, having it 20 feet away from your home. It's now equivalent in power to your gas and propane generator because it's going to run 99% of your oh, home yeah. appliances. This one is big. This is more powerful than the one I have. And I'll tell you, I have used mine so much. And I, I want to... My, my answer was too long, huh? No, 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 <laughs> no. You, first of all, this man hasn't slept in three days, so I, I'm am you're doing an amazing job. Um, there's so much to talk about with this. So um, there was a boat parade, a Christmas yeah. boat parade, right? You think, oh, emergency prepare. What are you talking about? We took our EcoFlow, put it on the boat, and plugged in all our decorations to decorate the boat and be part of this little boat parade that was in our little neighborhood. And it was, and host Valerie and her husband were on our boat, and there were some things on my Instagram if you want to see, I have a little video from it. That is one of many examples yeah. from all of us at, that work here, that own this, that use it all year round. Camping, RVing, um, in the backyard, you know, Halloween to have that big projector of the Halloween movie when the kids come by you know, have it plugged in. You use it all year round. But I'll tell you that um, this is on everybody's mind. I, I mentioned earlier, my daughter is, uh, live, li you know, we moved here from Los Angeles and she's living in San Diego and moving to Los Angeles today. Today is her moving day. <laughs> and I said, don't go on the roads. Don't move. Like, what are you doing? Like, don't even. Holding up a mattress. <laughs> yeah, right. Like a sail and uh, a I don't even, mile like, I'm, so, I'm so worried. But I, I, I will just say that power is, you know, it's nice to have, be able to cook and make a cup of coffee. But guess what? It's also great for life-saving things like a CPAP machine. Yeah. You and I always talk about the asthma that you and I both experience. I have a nebulizer, If I, and, and when you know you get anxious, your asthma can be worse. In an emergency, you not having your nebulizer and not having your power, that would all be scary. You know, your washing machine, your laptop, your microwave, your refrigerator, your television, your CPAP, your you know fluorescent light. This, this particular model, Justin, we're talking about a lot more stuff than the one that I own. I'm actually, if there's any left, I'm thinking about getting this one too because this one is like way more powerful than the one I own. Well, it's one of two that will power 99%. The next one's the Delta Pro. That's over $3,000. Right. So, and 100 pounds. Yes, so, and know, we do have it. Uh, do, uh, um, do we have it on hsn.com? I'm pretty sure we still have so it on So if you want com. that one, we do have it on hsn.com. We absolutely do. It, you know, I like this one because it's still expandable, like we said. It's still portable, like we talked about. For the first time recently, we just launched the ability to have a plug and play where you can actually have this connected and integrated into the circuit board in your home. So you can literally have this connected. So this can be used as like a storage mm -hmm. of power in your house. Right. And as soon as you lose power, this will act like your emergency uh, generator right. uh, to be able to power up 99% of your home appliances. So just something to consider because this can grow with you. This isn't something that you get and it's rudimentary and it just stays this way. You can have more solar panels. You can add more extra batteries. But here's the great part, it's so easy to use. One touch of a button, that's it. You know, we think about what do we need to do with a gas generator? One, we need to make sure, like we've talked about, it's gotta be, what, 20 feet away from your house, right? Well, with one touch of a button, just like a computer, I turn it on, there's no pull cranks, there's no fumes. And do you hear anything? It's completely silent. You don't have to worry about some loud generator running outside of your home. And of course, like I keep saying, you can't do it inside. 99 representing 99 hours, 98 representing the amount of percentage that we have. These zeros right here are gonna represent the amount of wattage in and wattage out. So as soon as I start plugging anything in, and I'll just go ahead and plug that fan in so you can see in real time, all of a sudden, it's going to calculate the wattage to the amount of time. So there's literally no guessing. Reason why we all like to kind of mention this is if you get a gas generator, it ain't gonna do that for you. <laughs> right, <laughs> okay? right, right. There's not gonna be an LCD display. There isn't going to be USB ports on the front for you to be able to plug all of your phones in so you can keep that line of communication. And you could do those all at once, right? You could poke your phone in while you have the light on, while you have your refrigerator Correct. going. You do all of it. All of it, all of it simultaneously. So we got 13 different devices right here plugged oh, in. There goes um, the light. There's the light right here's the back where you have all of your AC outlets. Um, and then we'll, we're going to ask the, the the god of thunder, make it rain. Okay. <laughs> make it rain. Oh, what? What's happening? What's the weather like?
I wish we could do like some some voice changing. <laughs> yeah. And then there was lightning. <laughs> and then there was lightning. Um, but you know, we never think about, okay, when we're sitting there and all of a sudden lights go out. Lights go what out. What the heck do, what do we, we do? What do we do? Okay, so now we've got our lights and our fans still running. We have independent power. I went over to um, the local grocery store, Helen. I was like, I'm just gonna get a few groceries. Like they gave me a list of stuff. It's like. It didn't seem like a lot. It was 200 bucks yeah. for 18 eggs, yogurt, cream cheese, butter. I had milk and orange juice and all the different vegetables they were getting. Clearly, the person who made this list is a very healthy person. They had me get <laughs> yeah. kale, too. Yeah, kale. Um, kale but, and ice cream. But I made, I made sure to, like, level it out with right. the ice cream and all of my frozen stuff. But now we've got water. We've got all of our produce. We've got right. all of our everything that we've got in here. $200 worth of stuff could be medicine, too. Look, my sister's type 1 diabetic. She's got to make sure that her insulin stays cool. Yeah. All the things that stay cool, but we need to cook eventually as well. So I'm just going to show you this. I'm going to close up the refrigerator real quick. I'm just going to go ahead and plug it in so you guys can see that this is going to be powering your full-size refrigerator, and all you got to do is plug it in. There's nothing that you have to think about. Okay, when we get There's this at refrigerator. home, what do I have to do to prep? What do I have to do to get ready to get this to plug in my refrigerator? You just simply plug it just right plug into it your in. device. That's you it. You plug it in. And will it say how long it'll power the refrigerator yes. for? Yes. So when we come back over here to the display, this is the nice part, you know, is that you don't have to sit there and kind of guess, well, how long is it going to run my refrigerator for? A full day. Nearly 24 hours, that's at 97%. And by the way, that's with my light and my fans still plugged in. You're going to have almost 24 hours. But here's the other thing. We have our microwave. Now, this microwave could be your air fryers, could be your coffee makers, right. could be, for instance, your uh, Nespresso machine. Right. Whatever you decide to have, your little French press, whatever it might be that you feel is essential for you. But we have these essentials in life. We've got food and we've got water. But again, you're going to want to be able to cook all of these different things that you're keeping cool. There goes but, your microwave's on, your microwave. fan is on, your light is on, yep. your refrigerator is plugged in all at once. All at the same time. All at the same time. And, and a microwave only, you know, one minute or 30 seconds or something like that. Well, I know. It's, it's funny because it's like, <laughs> it well, hour, it's only going to do it for an hour. I'm like, yeah, but how long are you going to run your microwave I, 30 for? 30 seconds, an hour. You know, I did. If, uh, you, if you microwave something for an hour, it is I did, nuked. I did one time. <laughs> did you really? I, was I think a, every dude has done I that. Well, I was a kid. Okay. Yeah, it wasn't okay. Like, that makes sense. It wasn't like I was an adult at this point. Okay. Um, and it was, uh, it was bagel bites. Oh, and what do they look like? I don't know why, <laughs> as a kid, I thought it says 40, it said four and a half minutes to like five minutes. I was like, I'm um, 41 to 42. I put it in for 41 minutes. My mom came, Justin, <laughs> what are you cooking right? in here? It will look like a hockey puck. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. no. But, yes, you it, it, it'll warm up your food and take it out of the freezer because yep. your refrigerator is working. This empowers so many things. And we're popping that on your screen, even your washing machine. Because yep. think about that. Maybe you power goes out. You didn't wash your uniform for work. That could be, like... A, you know, a big deal. So there you go. You're able to, you know, wash wash your clothes. You're able to, you know, heat your food. And one of the main things, like we're not talking about, but your router, the internet needs power. <laughs> you know? It does need power. It does need power. Um, I feel like everything in our life needs power. It's like, the well, more reliant we become on our phone yeah. or our, our, our laptops, everything in life is, okay, what can you power up? But reality is, is that that's just the life that we live in, right? We, we have our phones, we've got our tablets, it's right. our line of communication, it's our entertainment. I always think back to Sandy, when Hurricane Sandy came. People yes. were trying to find these restaurants that had a generator to try charge their phones right. just to say, just hey, to have I'm a phone, okay. Just to say, hey, I'm okay. <laughs> like, just to say, hey, I'm okay. Just to say, hey, and, okay. and by the way, we do have an extra battery. I know we only have a few hundred of those as well, and those have been incredible.